What's up guys, Rochester Gaming here, and welcome back to Surviving Your First 7 Days in 7 Days to Die. Uh, we are on day 6 now, it is 7 a.m., and we are going to get moving. Uh, we weren't very productive in our last episode here, so we're, uh, we're going we're gonna to get going as quickly as possible here. So what we need actually is we need some leather so that we can get the bellows for our forge. And what we're really going to do is we're going to head up north here. Unlock the door. We're just going to head... Oh, we're heading south. Oops. Like a dirt, we need to head north. Because up north here... There is a whole bunch of houses with leather in them. And the leather is what we definitely need here to do our bellows for our forge. So we're just going to beeline it there. We're going to kind of skip all the zombies because we are on a time crunch here. After that, basically what we need to do is start getting the shit out of wood so that we can make our people trap for tomorrow. So yeah, we're going to leave them here because up here is the radio tower on the left. Now up here, there's a bunch of zombies. They'll give you, they're the miner zombies, so they'll give you a mining helmet, which is really what I'm looking for. So let's go fight some of these here. hair here. Headshots are nothing. Go. Scrap this because there now we have a mining helmet, which is exactly what I wanted, so we can get some more light up in this piece. Oh, the utility workers zombies, I apologize. We're good. Let's just go in here and search this cart real quick. Axe. You can always use the axe. So we're gonna replenish the the arrows that I use there. It's 10 a.m. We gotta get moving because what I really want is down here. Now I probably could have went into the hospital in Deersville and gotten it a lot quicker, but this to me is a little bit safer because there's not a lot around here. Actually, let's bust out that axe. Hey, Chubby. Here. This one's 
a little quick. Their head to explode. That's always better. All right. Now, you have to be careful. This is always bringing enough arrows with you. Go ahead, hop over that fence. Look, just getting here, I gained a couple levels. Yep, these are better. All right, so now that we're actually up here and in through everything, we got okay, we got our bow. Load it, and now let's get in here and get some leather. I'm not going to place too, too much concern on searching in here, only because that's not really what I'm looking for. And here, look at all these fancy schmancy chairs. And I have nothing, no room for it. Where's these cans? Scrap. to 18 leather. Look at that, just that quick. Alright, guess we gotta go dig through one of the other houses quick. Now we're gonna try to avoid the zombies on here. Uh, I don't think that's really gonna happen. Down. As you can see, if you don't come prepared, they will make you pay for it. Use 
use that because we need the health. Here's all the leather I need. So now I need to go back and get that short iron pipe, and then I'm set. Might as well search and see what's here. Since we cleaned out the place. And our short iron pipe and our wrench. Nice. So we'll get rid of that. We'll get rid of that. And actually, we'll make that bellows. Alright, so we got our bellows. We got that. Now we just need clay, stone. Alright. Let's get out of here. Clay is going to be under the rocks. <sighs> under the rocks that you dig at. And it's going to have a, a different color to it. Like right here. Uh, what picked up uh, the lump of coal? here. That's a good start. Alright, that's good. So let's head back. It's 1800. Look how much brighter it is here with the mining helmet. That's like the first thing I always look for, is a mining helmet. If I can't do that, I always go there to the, uh, to the radio tower. Care about you. All right, so we are probably in for the night. It's twenty hundred. All right, so let's dump our shit. All right, so now we need a short iron pipe. What do we need for the forge? I mean, nothing. We can get it. Craft. Alright, so while we wait for that, in the meantime, see how much brighter everything is? Yeah, you're fine. Just gotta keep an eye on the time here. I'm gonna pick up... Minor 69 are basically 20% more block damage, 10% less stamina per swing on your mining tools. So we got an hour here to get a 900 tree. We're basically going to wear down what we can of this axe. I'm spending my last hour working with you. Alright. Alright, so we are officially in for the night. Forge. We're going to keep you up here. And now, 
and load you up with some shit. Okay, so the forge. Forge is where you can keep all your metal and and can basically anything metal related. Iron, brass, lead, glass, stone, and clay. Um, basically, you add wood to the fire, you smelt it, and then it adds it to the it adds it to the forge. So, prime example here. We have all this raw iron, so we're going to take all the raw iron out. This other lump of clay. And we are going to add this to the forge. And look, we're already, we're already seeing the things that we can make. So what we need, we need an anvil first. Because an anvil is what's going to require everything, mostly everything here to make. You need an anvil to make it, which... Cooking pot, cooking grill... But you need an anvil required. Leather tanning. I'm doing that, and only because <clears throat> it'll make me allow me to turn all the skins that I got into leather. There, we can finally make an anvil. So now that we have the mats on, I'm pointing like you're here. Now that we have the mats for it in the side, we can create the anvil. So we have the anvil, we can make the cooking grill, so we're just waiting for that anvil. Okay, bacon and eggs, gonna eat. Bottle of water. Let's cook all that. Alright, so let's get all this animal hide here, because animal hide armor isn't really all that strong. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn it all into leather. Okay, look, so the iron is all smelted. So now we're gonna take all of our other metals, the lead, more iron, where's the brass, and the brass, and the glass. So we're going to put all that in the forge here, and what I'll do is kind of, if you store things in the output, move the anvil up, store things in the output, it's kind of like a little bit of an extra holding tank, so I know, hey, this is what I need to, to make next. See, so look, now I can make all this stuff. Now, the cooking grill is going to allow me to take the meat from just charred meat to actual grill meat. So we're going to grill up the rest of this meat because it makes it a little bit better on your wealth. Oh, wealth on your wellness. So we got the water. See, now that we got this, we're going pretty good. And then we're going to burn the wood that we have, and we're going to make log spikes. Because we need to start working on our people trap. Now, the people trap is going to get good for the horde for tomorrow night. Okay, take that grilled meat. Put it in our bag. We're just pretty much going to do that here for the rest of the night. So, it's 4.30 in the morning now. We're going to do this, scrap them, and keep leveling up. And then tomorrow, we're going to be building our man trap. So we're going to be farming wood primarily all day. And making a shit ton of arrows. So, I'm going to leave this one here. And... This was a lot better than the last episode. I apologize, the last episode was severe dog shit, in my opinion. Um, I just couldn't find the leather that I needed. So, now that I have it, I'm, I'm a lot happier. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to go through Day 7. And Day 7 is Horde Night. So, we're going to be using a lot of arrows because I don't have a workbench yet to make ammunition. So... It's going to be an interesting evening, I'll tell you that. But I am Rockchester Gaming. If you like that video, hit that like button. If you dislike that video, leave a dislike and leave a comment below. Let me know what I could have done better or what you thought I could have done differently. Hit that subscribe button and you will see much more fun content from me as well as, like I said, Day 7 is coming up. So, I am Rockchester Gaming, and I'll see you in the next video.